Summoners, I'm Nika Sor here to show you this week's League of Legends fan creations, but you already knew that. We have a couple things I don't think you've seen before though. Perhaps medieval yordles? Walking castles? Yeah, we got it all. Let's check it out. There's a moment in every yordle's life when it's time to get serious. Psycho Penguin upgrades some of Teemo's notable features, making him into a sneaky assassin. His outfit is complete with a scope on his blowgun and some marvelous royal clothing. You know, Teemo may be serious, but he never stops smiling. Well, we've seen the button-eyed charm of Sown Chaos Oriana, if you'd call it charm. But Buffy Cafe Lunatic takes us to a new level, creating new champions for Annie's toy box. Like Fiddlesticks and his stitchy crow, Vladimir with a ball of red yarn, and Leona in full armor, whether she's a doll or not. Even though they're on paper and conceptual, they still look pretty huggable. So Andomiel has some of the most overlooked League art I've ever seen on her fingernails. She recreated entire scenes of Fiddlestick's farm on her nails, which can't be more than half an inch long. When you have awesome art on your nails, do you get a free pass on doing the dishes? There's even a tutorial video, so you can see it in action, but I'm not convinced that it wasn't just done by magic. Renekton doesn't boast about saving lives, but Canonize knows a good swimmer when he sees one. Being a lifeguard must be a pretty fun summer job, and as they said, someone needs to save Surfer Cinch when he wipes out. I have this visual of, of lifeguard Renekton running through the sands in slow motion on his way to save somebody, tail bouncing up and down. It's time to rock out. Ferdy K, I'm relying on you. Take it away. Ah, the metal. What's not to love? All right, so we got our metal, but how about our rock? Or a uh, stone, close enough? Thanks to Crynath, Blitzcrank has a new look, built out of other looks, built out of a fortress. I'm not sure if that would make him a golem, but he's turned a defensive structure into an offensive one. You gotta give him props, as you run, as he pours boiling oil on you. Looks like we are all set for this week, but if you have a creation you wanna show us, send a link to the Summoner Showcase email and include your summoner name, cause we like to give you proper credit. It's weird, right? It's a little known fact that the subscribe button is actually a distant relative to Ceiling Cat. You can press that like button if you wanna give the thumbs up or if you wanna mime holding an invisible lighter. Until next time, the subscribe button is watching you. Respect mobile fortresses. And we'll see you next week.